Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing my winter body care haul. I have not done like a body care, skin care haul in a long time, so I'm really pumped for this video. This is how the box looks like. We have quite a few products. I have body care, um, which is mainly for the winters. Um, I also have some new skincare which is something that I'm very happy about. Before we start the video, I quickly want to share what lipstick I'm wearing because I know you are going to be after my life. And so this is the Key Rose Lip Lacquer in the shade Roasted Walnut. Now that we have out of the way, let's get started with the video. First, I first let's do body care. So the first thing that I have, this is the Plum Body Loving Hand Cream in the variant Caramel Popcorn. I raved about this in my Instagram stories if you follow me there. And this just literally is like a caramel popcorn in a tube. Sweet, warm, cozy, like a caramel popcorn. It smells delicious. And also the fact that it moisturizes your hands so well my hands are so dry all the time they're, all, they're always so dry and like rough all the time so i reach out to hand creams a lot this is something that is very very light like gets absorbed very quickly into your hands um you know i'm a huge fan of especially the plums body loving range i think i have tried almost every variant almost every variant from their range and this is just so good it has been my staple this winter just giving my very quick review on these products because i'm going to make like a separate video with all of my favorite body care products and i'll try to keep it as affordable as i can the next product is also from plum body loving now i'm going to tell you i have quite a few products from plum body loving um because they make the one of the best body care products also in a very affordable range by the way i have a code with them it's an affiliate code uh, i'm gonna leave that in the description box this is a plum body loving shower cream in the variant hawaiian rumba now i have wait i'm gonna i have the shower gel from the normal gel shower gel from them so i i got the shower cream it's on the last leg don't come at me for it don't hate me for it but i feel like this range i like a little bit more than the vanilla vibes one i like the vanilla vibes one equally but if i had to choose this is a more moisturizing version of this one i haven't really gotten a chance to use this but i'm excited for my next shower because i'm gonna use this let's do a body lotion this one i'm gonna put it out there i got it in pr but i still wanted to mention this because because i have been wanting to try this particular body lotion from sugandha this is the lactic body lactic acid body lotion this is the unscented variant with my body like skin being really really dry i also have um strawberry skin on my legs i tend to get that a lot so i've been really wanting to try like an exfoliating body lotion i was in which way is going to buy this for myself to try it out and how it works but very kindly i got this as a pr and this is this has five percent lactic acid two percent niacinamide and calendula so this one being the exfoliating body lotion it also um is moisturizing that is what it claims i've used this once um i am looking forward to using this and see if it gives me any results okay another product that i have been dying to try out because of how much people like rave about this particular product this is again from plum body loving i told you and this is their body oil in the variant vanilla vibes now this is the smaller bottle that these smaller bottles are very easy to travel with. This is literally like a vanilla cupcake in a bottle. I've been using this almost every single day. I know why people are talking about this so much because it is so good. Like being a body oil, it does not feel very heavy and sticky on your body. Uh, once uh, I apply it, I think within a few seconds, it absorbs into my body. And also I've noticed that my body does not get flaky really really quickly what i mean is the moisturization of this body oil lasts for a long like a good amount of time i got a new body razor this one is from kamisi so for the longest time i've been using the gilletka venus razor um both the breeze one and the, the pink one um so i want so i was wanting to try a new razor you can see it's new so you can see like i haven't really even opened it this is 
This is the Kamasi body eraser. Mini. What made me drawn towards this product is is the packaging. Look how cute this is. Now this being cute also, it is very. I feel like it's very very travel friendly, and I really like products that you can carry with yourself in a very cute plastic case like this. Okay. The case like this, and it's so cute. I feel like uh, this can fit even in my handbag. The grip of this is going to be really nice. So I'm really excited to use this. Is this if I like it, you see in my body care video for sure. So it cannot be my body care video without body mist. I picked up these two. Um, again, I wanted to I wanted to do like an updated um fragrance perfume perfume video, which is why I'm trying out again new body mist. Um, the first one is again from Plum Body Loving. I feel like I'm being biased at this point, but guys, trust me, I'm not. Um, this is the EDP in the variant Orchidu Knot. I have my thoughts on this particular fragrance. I have tried so many body mist. I have tried their body mist and their EDPs and I will say that their EDPs last a little bit more longer than body mist but even the body mist being a body mist they last pretty long which is something that I love. Now this fragrance is something that I hadn't tried from Plum and I saw a few people talking about this. The reviews are really good and oh my god this smells good. Now how I can smell it is, it's a very fresh floral fragrance. I put the notes for you over here. But this is a very fresh floral fragrance. But it is very unique. Um, me being someone, I'm, I'm not the biggest fan of like very flowery fragrances. But this surprisingly, I really, really like. It's fresh. Uh, I feel it's a very offbeat and a very peppy fragrance. Something that's also very safe to play with. It's just, uh, this can be your everyday fragrance. It's so good and it lasts for a really long time. Um, I didn't think that I would like this fragrance so much, but you can clearly see I've used quite a lot of it. I use this almost every single morning. Let's talk about the next body mist. So this is from Bath & Body Works Champagne Toast. Um, this one, to be really honest, I got it impulsively. Um, they were having their so Bath and Body Works. I think the sale is still on, so they are having their semi annual sale like twice a year, and it is the best time to buy anything from them. Don't get Bath and Body Works products during the year, but wait. I wait for these two sales that happen in order for a candle, also, but that hasn't reached me. Or I think I got this for 350 rupees. The MRP of this is actually 70 or 800. Now, this one. With fragrances, they grow on me. Most of the fragrances, um, at least most of the fragrances, I have grown to like. And I, this is one of those. Right off the bat, when I smelled it for the first time, I was really overwhelmed because I had a very different picture in my head of how this would smell like. That is the case when you buy body mist online. But this is definitely a fragrance that not everybody would like it's a very strong fragrance first of all it's not mild and if you know I, I like very mild fragrances that's just how this one smells like very juicy um i don't know how champagne smells like but very juicy very 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 fruity so if you like very fruity fragrances then you're gonna like this one thing that i will point out is that um if you have smelled uh victoria secrets pure seduction the dry down notes of this is that now when you initially spray it it comes off as pretty strong um but the dry down of this is very very beautiful i love the pure seduction from um victoria's secret i have smelled it like multiple times the dry down of this particular one smells very very similar to victoria's secret pure seduction so if you like that fragrance you might end up liking this okay that is it for body care now let's come to skincare i have just two or three products the first one i want to give a shout out to this product in this video for sure uh, this is the sugandha's squalene cleansing oil now the reason i got this is because i have my makeup removers at my place and i'm not really at my place right now so i had to get a cleanser 
um, that is travel friendly which is very easy to carry and I thought of getting my slow water at first but I was like I have never tried a cleansing oil one is fragrance free and this product has just blown me is one of the best makeup removers in general I have used but it's so gentle it does not sting my eyes most of the make even the cleansing balms I've used some of them do sting my eyes but this one is so gentle it does not sting my eyes at all it removes makeup so easily emulsifies beautifully I have fallen in love with cleansing oils and there's no going back especially if you have dry skin cleansing oils can be really good for your skin toughest of mascaras like waterproof mascaras which are, which are not very easy to get rid of this does it for me we have a serum this is the l'oreal paris glycolic bright serum one percent glycolic acid i will tell you um influencers made me buy this honestly but i also had to test this for a specific video which you will see very soon this is the smaller version 15 ml i'm gonna save my review for that video but yeah i mean i like the texture of this it has fragrance to it it's not a very bothered carnivala fragrance but it has a mild fragrance to it so got this picked up a moisturizer for myself um i was looking for a good moisturizer and this dot and key one is kind of an underrated product i feel and i've seen like one or two people talk about it this is the dot and key ceramide and hyaluronic skin barrier repair face cream let me tell you um i my skin really loves ceramides i think ceramides in general are really good for your skin barrier for your skin so I have used the recoils ceramide moisturizer and i really like it so i was like i think i'm gonna like this this has probiotics and rice water ph 5.5 it is for dry to very dry skin and, and sensitive skin so perfect which is my skin type a lot of brands have taken into consideration the customer feedback um because i remember dot and key brands like dot and key had a lot of fragrance in the skincare reformulated and i'm so happy that this is fragrance free so since the time i started using fragrance free especially skincare i cannot go back like even the slightest bit of fragrance kind of bothers me i don't mind it but i just prefer my skincare to be fragrance free this one is has kind of a thick texture but it's not so thick and dense it's thick but it's also very lightweight um, and it's extremely moisturizing perfect for my dry skin especially in winters i don't know how this is going to do in summers but for now right now my skin has been loving this as product at lip balms now i got this is a very recent launch by fay beauty they have launched i think this has been one of the cutest and the most quirky launches which like lip balms inspired by desi drinks a uh, desi childhood drinks and i got two flavors because i could not resist myself i love the packaging soda pop killed it with the flavors this smells like coke float and it's, and i want to apply lip balm because of this next one is choco juma what a name it's inspired by a chocolate drink now this one I'm telling you, they have nailed it with the flavors. It smells so good. Now this one has a slight bit of a brown tint. This one is a non-tinted balm. It comes in a packaging like this. I love how they've put like so much thought into the packaging. It comes in a packaging like this and not a tub because most of the lip balms that I have comes in a tub, but this one comes in a squeezy. tube like this so it's very very convenient to apply it uh, i don't really like dipping my fingers into a tub and then applying it i prefer this so that makes it even better with that we are done with today's haul video i really hope you guys enjoy watching this goes without saying everything links to all of these products will will be in the description box below that is it for today's video thank you so much for watching Uh thanks so much for watching and I'll see you soon we and I'll see you soon in my next video. Bye. Bye the voice like this.